am Beats Dick. I am. Most people go to Chicago's limelight for the usual nightclub activities, dancing, drinking, or perhaps meeting new friends. But what you may not know about this ultra-chic club is that there's more to it than just mindless entertainment. Good night! Right! I would like to think that uh, so-called serious art is not that limited where it can only be experienced in a, in a very particularized environment. I would like to think that if it has strength, that if it has staying power, if it has a, a latitude or, or dimension of ideas, that it can be adaptable to a variety of circumstances, this being one of them. Chicagoan Ed Paschke is one of the nation's most prominent artists. His mural, entitled Mundo Ego, was commissioned by the limelight to adorn the walls of the dome room for three months. Having an artist of Paschke's stature doing a mural would be a major event even for an art museum, never mind a nightclub. And serious art lovers are usually amazed upon entering, according to Limelight Art Coordinator Billy Euler. You'd be surprised how many people who come in this building and walk in that room, and I, I mean a lot of people, and they'll walk in the dorm room and they'll go, oh my god, this is Ed Paschke. Oh, that's perfect. Well, sort of. <laughs> More or less. Keeping an element of surprise and amazement alive at the club is also the job of these performers, readying themselves for an evening of bizarre improvisation called performance art. Performance cases are the first thing you see upon entering the club. You may love them or hate them, but you can't ignore them. This may be viewed as an unusual form of artistic entertainment, but it's all part of the limelight philosophy, according to manager Russell Brunelli. We're not an old-style discotheque. We're not, you don't see mirror balls here or neon lights. Uh, the focus is on the people, creativity, and change. The themes for these cases change every six weeks or so, but on any given night, it's very unlikely you'll see the same thing twice. That's part of the challenge of these performers, who are all carefully chosen for these parts. We audition these people. I don't think there's anyone up there right now who is not an actor. I do it because I'm an actor, and this is a, a way to perform every night and do something um, in, in your art. I give energy to the club. I give an audience to the club that the club needs, otherwise it's just cement and ceilings. It's a good place to practice um, different kind of performance techniques. So if I wanted to practice mime for all night, I can do that. I've had women lift up their dresses and flash me. Art, entertainment, or silliness, no matter what you call it, it's definitely different. If they even don't like it, they'll bring people back to see it. They'll say, hey, come here, you have to see this, it's wild. I agree, wild is the word. <laughs>